I'm Aaron Nagler. I'm here with Chris Burke via Skype, breaking down the Tennessee Titans 2016 NFL Draft. Chris, well, the Titans have a lot of needs, and now they have a lot of picks. What or who do they target at pick 15 there in the first round? Same reasons we were talking about Laramie Tunsil at number one. You look at Taylor Decker, Jack Conklin, that range. I think defensive line is also a spot there. They could be in range there to get one of the best players along the defensive front. I think if it's if they like someone there, that's certainly an option. Is there a chance the Titans try to use some of their draft pick currency and jump back up into the top 10? I and mean, they've got plenty of picks to do so. Yeah, I mean, I think it would be on the board. And it's a class that is not all that top heavy. So if you have one of the top five or six names on your board still sitting there in a range you can get to, I think you've got to take a chance at that. And uh, as you said, they have the picks to go do it. I think there will be a lot of teams looking to trade back because the quality of this class is more in round two, round three than it is necessarily in round one. Now, general manager John Robinson said, quote, Taylor Lewin is our left tackle until he isn't. Uh, does he look hard at the tackle position in this draft? Yeah, that's not exactly stamping Taylor Lewan into place there at the starting <laughs> left tackle spot. I, I mean, I think that they have to look at the position. I expect him to take one or two uh, offensive linemen at least, but you know, you also don't want to force it. If they were really that set on taking an offensive lineman, they could have stayed put at one and taken Laramie Tunsil. He's the best offensive lineman in this class and arguably one of the best to have come out the last five, six years. So I think they'll look, but again, you know, they have so many needs. I don't think you go into round one, round two thinking, well, we have to get an offensive tackle. Talking about having a lot of needs, this team needs help in the secondary, both at corner and at safety. Which would you prioritize? I think I'd probably put safety atop that list unless they get the chance to go after a legit number one guy and they have that sort of grade on Vernon Hargraves or Mackenzie Alexander or William Jackson, one of them's there because they have some talent at the cornerback spot and assuming Jason McCourty has a good year and a healthy year, they could be okay there. I think they need more help at safety, but that's not a round one position really this year. So you can't really rule out anything, including doubling up on defensive backs in the early rounds. Now switching back over to the offensive side, the Titans made two picks at wide receiver last year, but does that take wide receiver off the board for the Titans this year? Who might they look at later on in the draft in the position? If you're looking later on, I mean, Daniel Braverman, someone, if you're looking for a slot guy, someone to move the chains for you, Trevor Davis is another one probably to remember for the Titans because a slot guy, great speed, can get downfield, but also really good as a return man, and that's probably somewhere they could use an extra boost too. Well, there you go, Chris Burke breaking it down for you, the Tennessee Titans 2016 NFL Draft. For Chris, I'm Aaron for SI.com.